You know, there are people who have no idea how, what it's like to be this sick and desperate and alone. And I don't, you know, I don't ask for any commitments from anybody. I don't ask for any, for anybody to walk into my life and, you know, when people offer things, that's a different story. And to offer somebody something when you don't follow through is, you know, being this isolated without transportation, financially destroyed, reduced to, you know, nothing, powerless, you know, no, you know, if I need things, I have to go without, I, I just, I have no options. There's no person I can turn to and say, hey, can you order this on your credit card and I'll pay you back. Um, I'm paying often two, three, four times more money for things at a local store here than wealthy people are paying at Walmart for just, you know, daily household supplies. I'm paying two, three, four times as much money as wealthy people are. I had someone order me a meal uh, from a local restaurant here and then they promised to you know I was it was wonderful then they promised that they would do this every two weeks for me order me a meal from a local restaurant a couple blocks away from me well that was six weeks ago so they might have forgotten for one week or two weeks or please Please don't make promises to people who are this sick and desperate. It's hurtful and it's harmful. It's better not to, it's better to do nothing at all than to make, make promises and get people's hopes up. Because you have no idea how desperate we are and how mean that is to make promises like that and not follow through. It's, it's best really to do nothing at all.